last night in the 400 medley relay. There is Arizona State, and there is the best swimmer in the world today, Leon Marchand, leading it all off. And Leyendo right alongside for Florida in five. Yeah, it, it, this field is loaded with stars, especially the leadoff legs. He's got the first, third, fourth, fifth, seventh place finish in the Hunter Freestyle, leading things off for these relays. And already, 50 yards in, this race is not disappointed on the front end. Four flips simultaneously, Crooks, Leendo, Marchand, and Giuliano. Marchand's underwater is just this underwater, Patrick. Watch it. Watch it. Don't take your eyes off the middle of the pool too, for just a second. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's check Marshawn's time. He's been challenged by Crooks, though. Marshawn comes in at 40.28 to open it up. Goodness. That'll kick things into gear in a hurry for the Sun Devils. No question about it. 40.2, brilliant leadoff for Crooks as well, 40.3, he just went his best time. All right, race is on now. Jack Dolan in the water for Arizona State. Tennessee with Micah Chambers. Dolan with six in the 100 freestyle, so arguably Arizona State is going with their two best swimmers on the front end in the 100 freestyle. Turn it back for home to the midway mark of this one. Arizona State in front. Patrick Sandman awaits the exchange. There he goes into the water. Arizona State in front. Florida second. Tennessee third. Tennessee has Santos in the water. There, two tenths of a second ahead of record pace right now at the halfway point. Now Salmon was 28th in the hundred, but he had a pretty good 200. So he's going to have a good back half, and he's 19-2 going out there. 50 to go, Salmon for Arizona State, extending the lead on a very game Julian Smith of Florida. All right, Julian Smith, we know him as that great bus stoker, but he is solid, 19-5 going out for him. Smith gaining some ground, as is Santos of Tennessee. Here's the exchange to the anchor. Johnny Kulo in the water for Arizona State. Florida closing with McDuck. Nice job for Smith, 41-2, brought him with the striking range. But McDuff is going to have to do something miraculous here to be able to overtake Johnny Kula, who was 13. We and saw I'm these two Rowdy go head to head in the relay earlier in the meet that Arizona was finally able to win. We saw Kulo drive McDuff off. He's trying to do it again. Final turn. Right on record pace. Bob Bowman jumping up and down, arms in the air in the rafters. Arizona State, Johnny Kulo coming to the wall to win the relay and the team national championship. And they do it in NCAA record time, 243-40. They lower it by almost three quarters of a second. There's no denying Arizona State national champs. Oh my goodness. I've seen Bob. That since, well, since a guy named MP did a pretty good job back in Beijing in 2008. Here's the first leg. Watch Leon Marchand. These are some of the best sprinters in the world today. Make no mistake, these are amazing athletes. But look at that underwater. It's just unbelievable. Here's the last exchange. Crooks, by the way, it was also spectacular. I don't want to take anything away from from Jordan Crooks and his underwaters as well. Here's the last exchange right here. And Johnny Kulo, sophomore. Look at that. Easy to read those lips. <laughs> those two. They averaged 40.8. That was the average. 